Hey guys! Thursday is a big day. Your GCSE results are coming out and they're going to determine what A-level courses you get onto. But have you picked the right A-levels? This is a very, 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 very important question and not one that can be ignored or put to the side because if you've made a mistake, if you've picked the wrong A-levels, now is the time to change them. Not in year 13 or at the end of year 12, now is the time to change them. And you can change them, okay? You can change them probably like maybe up to a month after about you started. Um, but it is really, really important um, that if you pick the wrong A levels, you change them sooner rather than later. Because, well, first of all, you're going to be missing out on loads of stuff that you should be doing. You're going to be wasting your time doing like a subject that you're not necessarily going to be continuing with. Um, and we need to get things sorted sooner rather than later. Um, so how do you know whether you've picked the right or wrong A-levels? It all depends on what you want to do after university. So um, if you want to go and do medicine, make sure you pick the right A-levels for it. If you want to go and do architecture, make sure you pick the right A-levels for it. Um, you can go and check out my series on how to pick A-levels, all about facilitating subjects, soft subjects, is psychology a science or not, what A-levels you need to study medicine, but we need to be thinking about the future, so a couple of paces in the future we need to be thinking about university. So you just spent a little bit of time for me thinking about what you want to do in the future, um, looking at universities, looking at what A-levels um, universities are going to accept, whether that's going to be good enough or not, and um, whether you've got the right combination, because we do not want to get to a year, 18 months time when we're thinking about UCAS applications. You've got your heart set on university, your heart set on a course, and then you come to apply and you realise that they don't accept that combination of A-levels which would be devastating, okay? So please, please, please spend a little time, a bit of time for me just thinking about your A-level combinations, whether you've picked the right set of subjects or not. Um, A-level chemistry is awesome, but then I'm completely biased. Um, so yeah, please think about your A-levels. Um, talk to your teachers, you're not too late to change.